guaranteed at my soul. You've heard it all before, honest, but I know. Uh -huh. Left these years ago, I was young and I'm old, still care for the void. Uh -huh. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow. Never see the end of the night for sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? Good morning. This felt so, so, so weird. I haven't talked to you guys in like two weeks. As you guys can hear in my voice, I'm very sick. I've been sick the entire 2020 and the beginning, like end of 2019. I got sick around like next day of Christmas. So yeah, I've been sick ever since then. Um, I'm feeling better, but I'm still sneezing, coughing. Yesterday, I was feeling horrible. Um, the entire day I had my bones were hurting like literally my bones were hurting um, At night I had a heater on heating pad on like everything. I was wearing like this thick sweater Blanket Like I needed to warm up my bones. I think in the previous vlog I told you guys my cousins from London are coming here and <clears throat> today well, uh, my sister and I are taking them to Venice Canal. I've never been there before. It's a beautiful sunny day, so it's a perfect day. Uh, I'm wearing 300 layers because I don't want to get sick more than I am. So I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. This teddy coat is a uh, like the softest thing you'll ever touch. I apply the five layers of foundation around my nose, and it's the, it, it's been 10 minutes and it's all gone. But yeah, let's just go. Um, we're gonna go pick up my cousins right now, and I'll take you guys along with us on our adventure touristy thing day. day and I don't know how I've never been here during daytime it's so pretty and calming and the houses are like next level gorgeous so beautiful like I'll film as much as I can but I didn't want to invade people's privacy um, half of their like basically living room is outdoors here it's so beautiful we got lucky with the weather too because it's been very rainy and like gray here but it's really sunny now. You don't want to go from the other side? Sure. People are in tank tops and I'm in coat and sweater. That's embarrassing for my soul. But I'm cold and I'm sick. What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? We're done walking here now. We're gonna go to a Mexican restaurant that my sister found. 
uh, we're gonna go for a lunch but yeah if you guys are ever come to Venice Beach I would highly recommend you guys coming here because it's absolutely stunning. so change of plans we were gonna go to this Mexican restaurant that my sister found um, but because we passed by it, it was not such a great place we didn't go we came home we changed and stuff because I was wearing the thickest sweater and a coat and it's not that hot it's like 78 degrees so we came home, I'm changing now, now we're gonna go to Americana, we're gonna go, there's this very cute cafe in Nordstrom, we're gonna go there to have lunch. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow. Never see the end of the night for sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love when everything's said and done? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love when everything's said and done? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love when everything's said and done? Americana. We just had lunch and my sister dropped me off and she's taking my cousin to my grandma's house. I'm starting to feel very very tired since I'm sick too. Like it, I did too much activity for one day. So I'm just gonna like wash my makeup and take a day quilt cool and probably like lay in bed until I felt, feel better because like my bones are hurting and I'm not feeling well at all. Like my chest area is in pain. Um, if I did anything exciting, obviously I'll take you guys along, but if not, probably I'll speak to you guys tomorrow morning. Uh -huh. Left these years ago, I was young and I'm old, still care for the void. Uh -huh. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow. Never see the end of the night for sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done, what do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done, what do we do to love?
is as soon as I pick up the camera, all the constructions around us start working. Like, I don't know what's going on. Still in my PJs with all hair and makeup. Today's photo shoot required me to be in PJs, which I'm not complaining. Love it. I think I spoke to you guys last on Saturday or Sunday when we came back from uh, Venice Beach with my cousin. I'm still sick if you guys can hear it in my voice. It has been honestly one of the most difficult two weeks of my life because obviously being sick is not easy and it's been the busiest two weeks like with my cousins being in town and obviously the holidays and now uh, after the holidays getting back to work and honestly very difficult to be sick and trying to live a normal life i was honestly sick and tired of feeling miserable in bed so yeah i woke up this morning i washed my hair put a face mask on put a hair mask on and all of the shebang did a good scrub and got ready basically i used this um thickening um, spray let me show it to you guys I used this on my hair today oh my god this gives you hair like volume like it's fantastic like I absolutely loved it when you spray it on on your wet hair it's a little bit crunchy not crunchy but like your your hair feels dirty but loved it and I curled my hair for a change today like I was sick and tired of having straight hair so yeah, I curled them. Um, so I got ready. I'm gonna film a um, lookbook for you guys today. Um, I bought a few items from Boohoo and Pretty Little Thing um, that I wanted to show you guys. None of them are casual outfits. They're all going out outfits, like they're dresses. Um, so I have a couple of events in January and February, so I wanted a night out dresses. Um, so the order was strictly night out dresses which I'll sh uh, I want to try them on for you guys and show it to you guys um, that's the plan for today uh, now let's go try on the clothes that I got from boohoo and pretty little thing I am wearing one of the items that I wanted to show you guys uh, but I'm not keeping this it's a bodysuit and I look like a pirate um, I didn't take this thing off because I'm not keeping it I just don't like the vibe of it if we are being honest it's a little bit loose around this area so I don't know if it was a little bit tighter I would have liked it better but I'm not keeping it but I'm gonna but I wanted to show it to you guys um, for sure but yeah this is one of the items it's from pretty little thing the first dress is this beautiful baby blush dress it's so cute I absolutely love this color um, it's a little bit see-through I don't know if you guys can see but if you wear like a shapewear or a sleeve underneath it's not um, it has the puffiest sleeves and it gets narrowed down um, the quality is not the best like you can see the reds coming out it's like a nude pink um, very cute it has this little ruffles on the side on the bottom as well super comfortable super cute like it hugs your body and yeah this is the first dress this is the second dress it's a bodycon um what are these materials called bondage bandage i don't know you guys know what i'm talking about um like this burnt orange dress with little cute like sleeves the sleeves are super cute and it sits like fard out like this and it has a zipper the zipper is in the front the back doesn't have anything super tight it hugs your body but i'm not gonna keep this the sleeves are very uncomfortable even though it has elastic but it's very uncomfortable like i can't raise my arm and it's like it's just uncomfortable uh, but it's a very beautiful dress and another issue that i saw it has it's the zipper the zipper is not the best like it gets stuck and the zipper is completely in the front and after the history of my dress ripping apart in the middle of the wedding i don't want to mess up with any zipper so that item is going back this reminds me of easter just so much like like doesn't this remind you of easter 
I don't know. It's too bright for me, but at the same time, um, Monta's birthday is in April, and um, her theme is going to be Easter. I mean, that's what we decide. God knows until then what's going to happen. Uh, but since it's near Easter, um, we decided to do like a Easter theme for her, for him. Um, I was like, this dress is perfect. Like, it's purple. I usually go for a pink. Um, not a purple fan, but like this will look very cute and it's very pastel. It comes with a little belt. Um, the sleeves are see-through and they have this little detail at the end and even at the bottom. They have the fringe at the bottom as well. So very cute. It doesn't have anything in the back. Um, just this little clasp in the back basically. And um, same material belt as the dress so this one i will be keeping because i want to wear that to montez birthday when i got this dress in the mail i wasn't very impressed with it with the quality with i don't know it just looked sh cheap but as soon as you put it on it looks like a designer item it runs a little bit boxy so it's like square I don't know how to say it. like yeah it, it's a little bit boxy on the bottom and this was a little bit big on me so i'm going to exchange this for a smaller size but i for sure want to keep it it has a little bit of edge to it it's not your regular nude dress because of the material i really like it um but it's a little bit big on me so i'm going to just exchange it for a smaller size this item i didn't try it on for you guys because it was too big for me this is a I think Balmain inspired um, blazer from Pretty Little Thing. Um, my mom tried to, this was a little bit big on me and they were sold out on all the sizes. My mom tried to um, fix it for me, that's what it's like, it has the pins um, to see if we can even make it smaller, but we can't. So um, this is the blazer, it's very cute, it's all pearls and like it has a lot of details and the back is simple it only has in the bar like edges of the bottom of it like it's very cute but unfortunately the sizing is not correct and it's like too loose and i don't like it like i like these blazers to be fitted and this one is not um so yeah this will be unfortunately going back but i absolutely love it it's very cute with blue jeans you like just imagine this but this is like not this bodysuit but a simpler bodysuit like blue jeans how cute does this look i they don't like black and white so i wouldn't wear complete black and white uh, but um i really like it with blue jeans so um, this one unfortunately is going back because of the sizing and the last item was this coat that i already showed to you guys I already worried the other day when we were going to um, Venice Beach with my cousin. It's this cute teddy coat, whitish nude color that I absolutely love. It's not completely white, it's not nude. And it's like this beautiful cream color and it's extremely soft, like extremely soft. And I think I got this for like 30 bucks or something. So like it's pretty affordable. Uh, comes with it um, belt. Um, very cute. And trendy i almost forgot to show you guys this dress um this pink dress okay so this i'm keeping this but only because of the color and i like the style if not the quality is so bad while i was steaming it it will it takes a stain it's one of those quality first of all it gets wrinkled like when you move your hand it gets wrinkled and also it takes stains when i was steaming it it stained few places like can you see it um it's really bad quality and like i don't think i would be able to wear it more than two times um but i really like the color and how it sits so i will keep this dress as well but i'm not the biggest fan of the quality of it it feels cheap but it doesn't look cheap yeah I try to stim it as much as I can for the try on for you guys I'm only keeping it because the color is beautiful pink and I tried to <clears throat> find another one but none of them had this pink 
they were all baby pink and this one's like a brighter so that's the only reason I'm keeping it. If not, the quality is not the best, but I like how it sits and all of that. So yeah, these are everything that I got. I'm gonna go change, take this out. And I made a huge mess out here while filming. Uh, I'm gonna just go clean up here and have a lunch and work a little bit. And then I will talk to you guys in a bit. No, uh, left these years ago. I was young and I'm old. Still care for the void, oh. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow. Never see the end of the night for sorrow. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? What happened today? Oh my god. Our plans changed 100 times today. So my cousin was supposed to come over to do things together, which I explained a little bit earlier. So that never happened and she just had things to do. Work things got the best of me. I had so much more emails to do and all of that. So I just completely finished working. It has been a very productive day. I finished three blog posts um, and I edited this video that is, you guys are seeing right now. I edited the half portion of it. In the afternoon, I started feeling very, very, very tired. I was like, I'm just gonna take a 10 minute um, break and sleep. Like, I'm just gonna take, take a 10 minute nap and then I'll get up and continue editing. It is now 5.20. So I slept for like an hour and a half, but it was needed. And I know, we still have Christmas decoration up. You're gonna still see two more weeks of Christmas here. So yeah, now I'm just gonna sign up. I'm gonna finish off this vlog. And I'm just gonna go take my makeup off, do a little bit of editing and chill with my family. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys on my next vlog. Bye!